Halloween night was also senior night for the Placer girls volleyball team as the four seniors for the Lady Hillman, Katie Krause, Becky Matthews, Claire McInerney, and Maddie Graham were all honored pregame before the big first place showdown against rival Bear River on Thursday night. So big, there was even a celebrity in the crowd. Yep, that's Alan from the Hangover trilogy with baby Carlos. As the action started off here, Bear River takes a 1-0 lead early on with Kristen Piera. She scores early on the kill for the Lady Bruins, but Placer comes right back. Maddie Graham, 13 kills on the night. Here's the first one. This makes it 12-11 Bear River in the first, and then Taryn Rath comes right back for the Lady Bruins, taking an 18-16 lead. More Maddie Graham. This one gives Placer a 23-22 lead in the first, and then a quick assist here from Claire McInerney to fellow senior Maddie Graham. Makes a 25-23 victory for the Lady Hillman in the first. Moving on to the second, Bear River would tie it up at 23-23 coming up. Piera had a great game, led all players with 14 kills on the night. She ties this one up for Bear River. But that was right before junior Raquel Chiarte went on fire. Here she gets the first of two kills at the net for Placer as Lady Hillman take the second set also 25-23 and a commanding 2-0 lead against Bear River. Both teams 7-1 coming into this one. Placer just one set away from securing first place in the PFL with just one match left. That's Amanda Giles. Her hit at the net, a little too strong for Hannah Christensen. And then finally, Chiarte finishes it off for the Lady Hillman. 25-16, a sweep over rival Bear River. Puts Placer 8-1, sole possession of first place in the PVL with only a match at Lincoln next Tuesday. Bear River falls to 7-2, tied with Colfax. For you know, um, we, were, we were a little anxious about senior night being on such a competitive match, and I think it was for the better. We came out so pumped up. Everybody was so excited to play tonight, and it was honestly like the funnest match I've had in high school. So the crowd was awesome. The atmosphere of the gym was great. It was a really fun game. It's amazing. I, it's so hard to find words for it. We've worked for this, and we it's such a big deal, and Bear River, they're such a good team. They're very competitive, and we just played hard, and we, we played better than them, and we did so good. I'm proud of everyone. Do me a favor, look around. This is your senior night. What's it feel like? It's, it's incredible, and I'm so happy to end it this way, so, yeah. It's a playoff-like atmosphere tonight. It's always like that between the two of you, but how big was this on senior night for those four girls to walk away winners? I, it's huge. I mean, that's everything. That's what you want to do, and, you know, on Tuesday, we took that away from another group of girls, and I think our girls just were not going to let that happen to them tonight, and we did. Bear River played amazing. They dug a ton of balls. They're super smart, making a bunch of shots. I think we were able to adjust better this time than we were the first time. We played them, didn't make as many mistakes, and I think that was the difference. Right momentum going into playoffs next week. That's right. we got to keep it going. Sections now. We we talked about it. We said it, it would have been sweet to get you know our third in a row with the PBL, but our eyes are on that blue banner, and we got a test against Colfax, a team that is in Division Four. They beat us once, and so you know we're our hearts on Colfax right now. We got it. We got to get a big one on Tuesday, and uh, got to get ourselves set up back for playoffs so we can make hopefully another run. So. And reporting from Earl Crab Jim for the Auburn Journal, I'm Trevor Horn.